The hundreds of island nations that make up the South Pacific may require some travel, but for many, the journey is well worth the trouble. Unspoiled beaches, impressive historical sites, and a relaxed atmosphere make up this fast region, which is perfect for a getaway. However, choosing which remote paradise to prioritize may be difficult given the abundance of islands in Melanesia, Micronesia, and Polynesia. That's where we come in. In this video, we compared the best Pacific islands based on travelers' feedback, expert recommendations, accessibility, and affordability, as well as a variety of attractions available. Number 7. Solomon Islands The Solomon Islands are a great place for eco-tourists because of their abundance of unspoiled natural wonders and lack of conventional lodging. Intense jungles can be explored, uncrowded waves can be served, and even a dormant volcano can be scaled. History buffs can find historical artifacts like abandoned tanks and amphibious vehicles scattered throughout the islands because the nation served as a battlefield during World War II. The sites in the waters surrounding the islands, however, may be the most unusual. Divers from all over the world come here to see the World War II oil tankers, seaplanes and submarines that have sunk in the Solomon Islands. Number 6. American Samoa Although you will need a passport to enter this US territory, you will appreciate the convenience of paying for lodging, meals, excursions, and other trip necessities in US dollars. The island is a fantastic choice for a South Pacific vacation because of this benefit, as well as its rich culture and abundance of attractions. For easy access to the airport and must-see locations like $2 Beach and the Tawisi PF Sunya Ocean Center, Base yourself in Pago Pago, the nation's capital, onto Tuila Island. Don't forget to allot time for American Samoa National Park's World War II Heritage Trail and snorkeling. Number 5. Cook Islands Despite its small size, this group of 15 atolls and islands offers something for everyone. Popular activities range from snorkeling excursions and hikes to waterfalls to village tours. The striking white sand beaches on Araratonga and Aitutaki also can't be missed. After exploring, savor local staples like ikamata, marinated raw fish, and poke, a pudding-like dish made with tropical fruit, at a market. Meanwhile, make sure to attend an island night celebration, which combines traditional dancing with a umukai, a buffet-style feast. Because the Cook Islands are associated with New Zealand, visitors can easily fly here from Auckland. Number 4. Moria Consider taking a honeymoon on Moria if you want to see a lesser-known aspect of French Polynesia. This more affordable, laid-back island offers the same kinds of breathtaking natural wonders and romantic accommodations that honeymooners will find on Bora Bora. Furthermore, Moria is only 10 miles from Tahiti, making it simple to get there from the principal international airport in French Polynesia. When visitors get to the island, they'll see eight tall mountains two lovely bays, and a number of interesting sites like Tomei Beach, a lagoonarium, and the Moria Dolphin Center. Number 3. Fiji If you enjoy both outdoor activities and cultural attractions, Consider visiting one or more of the Fiji's 333 islands. You can take part in a traditional kava ceremony in Suva, the country's capital, watch a firewalking festival, and visit Fiji Museum. The kava ceremony involves drinking a beverage made from the Yakona root that has mild sedative properties. The Yasawa Islands and Tafiuni, two of Fiji's smaller islands, have breathtaking beaches, 
coral gardens and rainforests that are just waiting to be discovered. When you've had your fill of hiking, snorkeling and sunbathing, retire to a posh five-star resort, a hip boutique hotel or a rustic bungalow. Number 2. Tahiti Tahiti is an obvious choice for a South Pacific vacation due to its international airport and a variety of big city amenities. Consider diverse restaurants, exciting cultural events and numerous five-star resorts. Contrary to popular belief, Tahiti also has a plenty of gushing waterfalls, soaring mountains and breathtaking beaches to provide the backdrop for your island getaway. Prior to visiting one of Tahiti's astounding natural wonders, start your trip by exploring the markets, shops and nightlife options in the capital city of Papiti. Fautaua Waterfall, the Vaipahi Gardens and Papinu Beach are among the must-see locations. Number 1. Bora Bora this French Polynesian island is the ideal destination if you want to spend your vacation pampering yourself, getting back in touch with nature and turning up the romance. Overwater bungalows, opulent spas designed for honeymooners, a stunning turquoise lagoon and the lush Mount Otemanu are all found in Bora Bora. Enroll in a boat tour that includes a shark and stingray feeding for an adrenaline rush and a general overview of the island. Then retire to your resort's private beach or Matira beach to unwind as you watch the sun go down. That covers our list for the best destinations to visit in the Pacific Islands for 2022. If you enjoyed this video, help us out with a like, comment and subscribe. I'll see you all in the next video.